Okay. No, 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 no. Okay, hello guys. Welcome. Thank you for being on time. Uh, excuses because I have a class before this one and I take like uh, like all the time, just a couple of minutes in order to finish one group and after that, uh, start with all of you. Let's see how many we are today. We are 12. What about the other ones? Guys, there's something that, oh, I will be listening. I feel, oh, Carlos, he's feeling bad. Okay, I will be listening. Okay, Carlos. Okay. Mm -hmm. Carlos David is feeling bad. Um, let's see, to guys, uh, this is something a little bit worthy because I I don't know what is happening with the other one. I know that you maybe have a lot of things for to do. Some of you are coming late from work, but please, the majority of the time, try to be on time because as I was mentioned to you, in, in one moment you might have like a, some trouble with the attendant list because I think if the, in, in three attendant lists, you, uh, you don't have the whole complete class. Uh, I think you might have some problem with attendance and you, and you need to have like the 80% of the attendance in order you get your, your degree. Okay, let's start talking about the attendance and all of that. Oh, okay, Liliana said that he's on his way, uh, on her way home, okay, yeah. I think I think the majority of, of you maybe arrive late at home. How many of you arrive late at home, guys? How many of you, the ones that are connected today? Oh, you don't have too much problem with, with traffic. But mm, don't worry about that. We're going to share the screen and see what we have for today. Let me check this part. Okay, A, B, C, D, and E. We have five. Five section. Let's move right here. Okay, I'm going to share the screen. Let's move right here. Okay. Mm. Okay, guys, let's see what we have here. Uh, how many of you did, uh, did get a good grade on the the meter, or or maybe get all of them right? The majority that we have here today already complete the the meter. La mayoría terminó el examen. Yes. No teacher. No, who said no? Who said? Hi. <laughs> me, me. Me, 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 me. Ah, oh, you. Astrid, yeah. you haven't finished. No, not yet. Okay, but remember, you have until to tomorrow at midnight in order to finish the section three because then next week we need to start working on section four. And the and the instruction were that you must have completed uh, the whole section before the the Friday at midnight. You have time. You have the whole day of tomorrow. No, I uh, that part. Yes, I I I already did it. Mm, ah, okay. Thanks. Thank you for that. Okay, guys. Let's see what we have here for today. Here you have, read, read this sentence and choose the correct part of the two-part bear missing. Oh, guy, who remember the two-part bears? Remember the two-part bears? Two-part bears, that means?
That means two different verbs that makes one whole completely meaning or a new meaning or a different meaning. In this case, we have the number one. Please clean. Clean up. up. Clean up. Clean up. Clean up bedroom. It's clean up bedroom. Clean up bedroom. It's really mess. mess. It's really mess. Here it said it's really mess. It's really mess. I think it is 100% mess. Okay, let's see what we have here. Uh, could you please put the groceries in the kitchen? Could you what? Could you away. please put... put away? Mm. Mm. Could you please put off the groceries in the kitchen? Mm -hmm. Put over, put off, put away. Mm -hmm. Put over? I don't know. Who said that? No word. Put away. What, what did you say, Robert? Away. Oh, Hello. okay. Yo no, yo, no había, yo no había dicho. Ah, ah, sorry, sorry, uh -huh. because I, sí, no. yeah, I confused Pero with it. With... Creo que es put away, put away. Do you consider that it is put away? Okay, Let, let's keep you on the way. <laughs> let's keep put you. Put away, well done. But, uh -huh. Let's keep you on the way, put away. What about the number three? Can you turn? Down. 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 Down the TV while I on the phone. phone. Mm -hmm. What about the second part? Instructions. Read the sentence and choose between an infinity or a zero. What it is an infinity, guys? Mm -hmm. What is an infinity? Who remember what it, what it is an infinity? Mm -hmm. What it is an infinity? A proposition two with a simple simple form of the verb. The proposition two with a simple form of the verb. The, um, that might be. Mm -hmm. What about the year? It's when in the when you use for and you add e i n g to the verb when you use a verb and that verb to change it into ing form that means a gerund or in spanish or better say you can call it gerundio you can call it gerundio that that's that's mean translating into into spanish and that will be that will be good don't worry about that. Okay. We already discussed about the difference and infinity and a zero. Let's continue. Uh, microwave ovens are used. Are used for what? For cooking. For cooking. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ta 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 ta. Do cooking. For cooking. For, for mm -hmm. cooking. Okay, some of you said for cooking, some of you said to cook. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's keep it between the number two and the number three, right? The majority said two or three, right? One. <laughs> oh, one, one. Okay, one and one and one and one and three. Second. <laughs> no, some others say one, two, three, teacher. Ah, okay, that's no problem. One, two, three, though. That is all up to you. That's doesn't, doesn't matter. Don't worry. Don't worry about that. 
That is the only thing that you want. <laughs> you make me loud, guys. Yeah, okay. You 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 have like uh you have something on under your your slips. <laughs> okay, the three the uh Gabriela said the three options. Yeah, that might be Gabriela. Let, let's go into see later. Uh, for me, two. Ah, for you the number two. Ah, okay, okay, yeah, the number two. Okay, let's keep it that way. Yeah, the number two. What about in the second one? When you go to the beach, try. Try what? Try what, guys? Not get it. Not getting the concorder wet. Number two, let's keep it away. What about the number two? You can use my cell phone. Mm -hmm. To leave, I think. Who said that? Me, Elena. Elena, Elena, where are you? Oh, Elena Marisol. Yes. Can ah, okay. you hear me well? Yeah, I, okay. I hear you. It is like, like the song. And you, can you hear me now? Don't worry about Elena. <laughs> I, could, I could hear you very well. Okay, you say number three, right, Elena? Yes, I think. Okay, number three, right. Okay, let's continue. Let's move to the number four. Don't forget your NTN car with you. To take. To? To take. To take. To take. Who thing might be taking? Mm-hmm. Everyone say say to take, right? To take. Let's say to take. Now we have to check the, the, the answer. Uh, okay, guys. And what we are, let's go to see and check our answer. Okay, guys, we were talking about the two perverts missing. Please clean up. Who said clean up? Who said clean up? Who said clean up? Raise your hand, the one who said clean up. Mm -hmm. oh, okay, 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 okay. Okay, you were right. Clean, clean up. Clean up. Bedroom is really a mess. What about, could you please put? Put, put away. Put away. Oh. Put away, put away the grocery in the, in kitchen. the kitchen, the kitchen, in the kitchen, in the kitchen. And let's see what we have here. And nobody mentioned put over, right? Or put off. I think the majority said put, put away, right? Put away. Okay, let's see the number three. Can you turn? Turn down. Turn down the TV while on the phone. Oh. While on the phone, okay. While on the phone. Let's see what we have here. Microwave oven are used for cooking. For cooking. Who said, I remember who was telling me Gabriela, you were telling me this one, right? Gabriela got lost, I think. 
Gabriela. Hello. Hello. Gabriela, this one was the one that you told me the number two, right? Yes. Ah, you you were right. You were right. For cooking. Yeah, for cooking. That's why I'm moving this way also too to see you for cooking. Okay, for cooking. Let's see who is typing. Teach you short ordinary connecting what's happening in the and you see the relation of the other. Oh, okay. Okay. But now we have to, now we are going to see something, guy. Why do you think we use for cooking? Why do you think we use for cooking instead of just cooking? Because in some cases, the preposition for can be used with an ing for a uh, verb. You're never going to use the, the preposition to with an ing for. Never oh, yeah. going to, you're never going to use the preposition to with a verb in ing for. You can use the preposition for, or just you can use, or you. Para cocinar. Mm -hmm. eh, para cocinar. Okay, that means translated into, into Spanish. When do you... When do you go to the beach? Try. Try not to get the concorder wet try not in this case not what what might be guys not might be a negative or a positive form negative. a negative form a negative form that might be a negative form try not to get we are using an infi we are using an infinity. Okay. What about this one? You can use my cell phone. You can use my cell phone to leave a voicemail. To leave a voicemail. What we have here? We have an ing for or we have a preposition. Mm -hmm. What we have here, guys? What do we have here? We have a we have a preposition. Remember a preposition to leave a voice message. What about the number four in this case? Don't forget to take to take. In the case of this one. Uh, in the case of the ing4, this one that we have right here, just taking, why do you think we can use it here? Why we can be used? I'm going to give you an idea, guys. This ing4 that we have here, it is an adjective in ing4 that is used to describe something. But in this case, because we are talking about a uh, zero or an in infinity. In this case, the action requires an infinity. In which one it is an infinity is to take. That's the that's the infinity that we are going to use because the whole sentence requires only an infinity. The sentence doesn't require a, a, a zero for or a, or this or another option that we have that we have here. Okay, now we are going to now we are going to move to the next one and see what we have here. Let's see to the bar to the bar B. Let's go and see what we have in part 
B. What we have here, rewriting. Rewriting, let's go to see what we have here, okay. Instruction, rewrite the sentence, use the correct for, the correct for the word given, remember to add a question mark at the end of your request, okay. Mm -hmm. We have another one, okay. Where is he? To tomorrow, the end of your request. Okay. Even if we have hit the, the explanation in Spanish, escriba nuevamente las oraciones, recuerde colocar el signo de pregunta al final de la petición. Close could the door, close please. The door? Could, you, could you close the door, please? Could you close the door, please? Okay, my, my apply in that way. Could you close... Could you close the door, please? Okay, it might apply. Let's see what we have here. Play, please take out the garbage. Will you please take the garbage out? Would you please take out the garbage? Oh, or would you please take the garbage out? Out. Oh. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Remember? Two part verse, take out, take out. Two part verse, difference. Okay. Don't sit here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Would you mind uh, not sitting there? Ah, would you mind not sitting here? Okay, thank you, Maria. You mind not sitting here. What about in the number four? Please take the cat out. Can you please take the cat out? Mm -hmm. Can you please take the cat out? Mm. Yeah, that, 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 might, that might apply for here. I think that might apply here. Let's go into see the number five. Repeat that, please. Could you repeat that, please? that, please? Could you repeat that, please? Could you repeat that, please? Okay, could you repeat that, please? Let's go to see the answer and see if we have it good, we have it wrong. Okay, now we're going to see the following answer. You see? Oh, Would you... oh yes. who's, who's falling asleep? <laughs> yeah, I have heard that, that, that big noise. Yeah. You were very contagious because I, I also, I, I'm like getting uh, falling I, asleep. I yeah. agree. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, don't worry, guys. I, I'm just kidding. Let's Let's continue with the class. We need to, to do some icebreaker during the class because you need to wake up again. <laughs> Could you close the door, please? Okay, that's, it's okay. How do we say this number two? Would you please take out the garbage? Remember the other one that I tell you, would you please take the garbage um, out? Mm -hmm. We have two different ways. Remember mm -hmm. that we, in the in whatever sentence or statement we have the the structure of tupa tupa bear what can we do we can have it together or we can have it separate but what is going to separate the two part bears the known the known is the key in order to have the two part bear separate that's everything in this case, don't sit here, would you mind? Okay. Uh, who said this? I think I have it over here. Maria, remember? 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 Uh, remember, Maria, what you were telling to us? Would you mind not sitting? Yes, here. yes, yes. Okay. Yes. Okay, you were right, Maria. You were right, Magdalena. You were right with this one. Would you mind not sitting here? 
Okay, what about the number four? Please, please take the cat out. Can you please take the cat out? You see, guys, two partners separated by the noun. Cat, we have take and out, the two partners. What about this one? Repeat that, please. Could you repeat that, please? Or could you repeat that, please? What is the difference? It's either the same, could and could you, you. Repeat, repeat. Oh, the comma. The comma is the difference. You, you can you. Oh, I didn't see that coming. The, the two ways might be, might be good. With a comma and eh? with a comma. Could you repeat that, please? Well, that, those are great. Wait to see what we have here. Okay, we have three more sections to play. And any question about this? Or everything is clear? I think everything is clear for you guys. I need to move to the section C. And let's see what we have on section C. The CC section. Oh, in the CC section, we have. Ah, I don't know why I did this. Oh, we have a way, guys. I need to look for that. For that audio. I was forgetting that part. I need to look for that audio. Let me check over right here. I need that out there. It is the C part, right? Section three meter M5 for, for that out. Okay. Guys, I'm going to play the audio. Please pay attention and we are going to check the the, the possible answer that we're going to to select. Listen to the conversations. Check the correct answers. One. Hey, Stephanie, have you seen Richard recently? I've left him a few voicemails, but he never calls me back. Is he okay? He never calls me back either, but don't worry about him. He bought a new computer last week. So? So, he spends all day and night on his computer. He's become a total geek. Really? He never used to like computers. Well, he does now. He never goes out and has fun anymore. Two. Hey, Martha, can you come help me? I'm having computer problems. You? But you're such a technophile. You're always surfing the net. Yeah, but I don't know how to do everything. So what's the problem, Barry? Wow, what are all these photos doing on the table? I'm trying to scan them so I can email them to friends. Oh, scanning is easy. Place the photo here. Be sure to put it face down. And then double click on this. That's it? That was easy. Three. Guess what, Eva? I just bought a really cheap plane ticket online. Really? I always go to a travel agent to plan my vacations. Well, you can sometimes get cheaper tickets on the internet. You should browse some websites. You have a computer at home, don't you? Yeah, but I never use it. Why not? What's wrong with it? Nothing. But my roommates are always playing games on it. When I tell them I need to use it, they say they're just going to finish the game, and then... Four. How do you like your new computer, Carlos? Actually, Heather, I prefer my old one. Really? Why? There are so many things I can't do. I don't know how to highlight text, drag and drop, or cut and paste. I could do all that on my old computer. And please don't tell me to read the manual. <laughs> Let's take one problem at a time. Okay. I want to highlight those two words. Just use your mouse, like this. And then press this key here. That was easy. Thanks. Okay. Did you hear everything, right? Did, did you hear everything? Escucharon todo? Yes. Okay. 
Uh, would you like uh, to play one more time? But could you repeat the video, please? Okay, we're going to repeat the audio. Don't worry about that. We can the do audio. it again. Hi, the audio, please. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Again. Don't worry. Okay, now we have a now we have it right here. Okay, let's we're going to repeat it again. Listen to the conversations. Check the correct answers. One. Hey, Stephanie, have you seen Richard recently? I've left him a few voicemails, but he never calls me back. Is he okay? He never calls me back either, but don't worry about him. He bought a new computer last week. So? So he spends all day and night on his computer. He's become a total geek. Really? He never used to like computers. Well, he does now. He never goes out and has fun anymore. Two. Hey, Martha, can you come help me? I'm having computer problems. You? But you're such a technophile. You're always surfing the net. Yeah, but I don't know how to do everything. So what's the problem, Barry? Whoa, what are all these photos doing on the table? I'm trying to scan them so I can email them to friends. Oh, scanning is easy. Place the photo here. Be sure to put it face down and then double click on this. That's it? That was easy. Three. Guess what, Eva? I just bought a really cheap plane ticket online. Really? I always go to a travel agent to plan my vacations. Well, you can sometimes get cheaper tickets on the internet. You should browse some websites. You have a computer at home, don't you? Yeah, but I never use it. Why not? What's wrong with it? Nothing. But my roommates are always playing games on it. When I tell them I need to use it, they say they're just going to finish the game, and then... Four. How do you like your new computer, Carlos? Actually, Heather, I prefer my old one. Really? Why? There are so many things I can't do. I don't know how to highlight text, drag and drop, or cut and paste. I could do all that on my old computer. And please don't tell me to read the manual. <laughs> Let's take one problem at a time. Okay. I want to highlight those two words. Just use your mouse, like this. And then press this key here. That was easy. Thanks. Okay. We pay attention, right? What? What we have in the number one? What What Stephanie said about Richard? That Richard is a a geek. A what? A a geek. A, a, a geek. A geek. Okay. Then we're going to check our answer. They say it is a geek. What about Barry? Barry asks Martha how to. Scan photographer. Photographer. Scan photograph. Scan photograph. Scan photograph. Scan photograph. Okay. Scan According to Eva. Eva. Mm -hmm. her, her room. Her room. Her room. Use, use, use her computer, computer a lot. A lot. Mm -hmm. Her room. Use her computer a lot. Heather shows Carlo how to use his new computer too. Highlight text. Highlight text. Highlight text. Highlight now we're going text. to see our, our answer. Yeah. Uh, Stephanie said Richard is a geek. What is a geek translated into Spanish? Mm -hmm. Adicto. Adicto. Mm -mm. Aquí is someone. Yeah, very, very smart person. In, in Spanish, it might be a better, uh, you might better hear like a cerebro. Yeah, that means a geek. That, that, that is a geek. A geek, okay. Barry asked Marta how to 
scan phot photographs. Yeah, you were right, guys. Scan photograph Ph because photograph. he was he was good oh. at, at surfing the net, but he mm -hmm. was not scanning photo because he want to scan some photo to send it to their friends. What about according to Eva? Her roommate used her computer a lot. Mm -hmm. That's why she can use her uh, her own computer and she is ashamed to tell him uh, to borrow her computer. <laughs> what a case. That is a big case. Okay, let's go and see the number four. Henry showed Carlos how to use his new computer to highlight text. Highlight text. Because in the old computer that Carlos had, he knows how to do everything. But in his new computer, he didn't know how to do it. And, and this girl uh, appeared and show him that was uh, something very easy. Use underline and use this, this, uh, what, what, she mentioned like a, to touch something. I don't remember where that, that she mentioned. Uh, to, to, to touch like a part of the keyboard, something like that. She mentioned a letter, but I can't remember where, which one was. Okay, we were not completely lost. How many of you, did yeah, get okay. good at first time and in your first try how many of you did get good all of this one mm -hmm. how many of you guys cuántos le salieron buenos en su primer intento how many of you i think nobody don't worry about that we need to move to the deeper it is a reading oh reading 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 okay read the letter to sally and her response check the correct answer dear sally we live in in a neighborhood where everyone knows each other and we all get along pretty well however a new family recently moved moving and now we have some problems the families Two teenagers mm -hmm. play with their music really loudly. When we politely ask, would you mind turning the music down? They just look it at us. Next, the family destroyed the beautiful tree. Oh, I hate to see them cut it down. I ran out and shoot it. Oh, shoot it. Could you please leave the tree alone? But they chop it, it down anyway. They also have dogs that bark loudly all day. We have said many times, please keep your dogs inside at night so we can get some sleep. But they won't do it. They won't know that. They don't they won't know what to do anymore. How can we all get along? Dear slowly, you have a ma you have you have made polite requests with no result. The next time you hear loud music or Barking dogs, call your local police. That should solve. Yeah, that's what he has to do. Call the police. That should solve the problem. Unfortunately, there's nothing you can do about the tree. Try to say politely and let the police take care of the of your neighbor. That's what he has to do. Call the police and, and put everything in order. Why you you're going to be uh, fighting about everything now? You're going to be like a Oh, having like a very, 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 very stressful day, a stressful week, and you're going to fight with your neighborhood now and try to, to fix your problem in a better way. Okay, here we have the first question. How did the teens respond to the neighborhood requests? They didn't say anything. They didn't say anything. Yes. Anything. Mm. Okay, let's let's make keep it in a way. But they, they said we're sorry. Well no, they didn't do that. <laughs> they they didn't apologize with their neighbor with the neighbor. And they said, mm -hmm. Are you kidding? We like loud music. No, they didn't they didn't say that too. 
Uh, they didn't say anything. Yeah, I think that might be the letters. The number three might be or or better option, right? They didn't say anything. Wait, guys, one minute. Uh, okay. What happened has the tree was being chopped down? The new family the new continued The new family asked to live alone. alone. Yeah. That's what the new family was telling today. To leave their their tree alone. Um, let's see. The new family continue. The new to family cut it continue down. to cut it down. Yeah, the new family continue cut it down. They didn't care what the other person said. Yeah, they start. They continue cutting the tree down. That was everything what they did. What is the problem with the dogs? They are outside barking all the time. They are outside barking all the time. What is barking, guys? Ladra. Ladrar. Okay, ladrar, thank you. Barking. Barking. Okay. What was Sally advice? Let the police solve the problems. Let the police solve the problem. Let the police office Let solve the, the problem. Yeah. Uh, in the U.S., it's not like here in the suburb. In the U.S., when a, uh, when, a, uh, when your neighbor, when there's problem between neighbors, the only person who can help to call down the two parts is the police. The police arrive to the place and start dialoguing with their neighbors. And, and the police officer try to solve in, in a like in a short way the, the problem that they were having. But in this case, it is like a if some some of them it is suing or the other one that those are like a worst cases because you can have you need to go to the court and you need to take a lawyer but if the problem are just like a, the one that is mentioned here that you cut down a tree in order to cut it down a tree you don't need to, to ask for permission you just call to the to the company uh, that company is the one who who is in charge of the of the permission. And in the case with the dogs, yeah, that's that that's better what they have to do. Call the police and say that they were having with the having problem with the neighborhood because they have dogs and they spend the whole night barking outside. And that is a problem with 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 them, right? Because the dogs are not quiet the whole night. Now we're going to check our possible answer and see if, which one we have right and which one we have wrong. Okay, let's see. How did team respond to the neighbor request? They didn't say anything. That is what the text said. What happened as the tree was being chopped down? To cut it, to cut it down. Uh -huh. En buen salvadoreño le siguió dando. Le siguió dando. That 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 doesn't stop them. And now they continue cutting the tree down. Okay. And what about the number three? What is the problem with the dogs? Okay, you were They're right. Outside. They barking. are outside barking all, yeah. all the time. Yeah, that that might be like a very annoying because even with my dogs, when it's, they start barking at night, I just scream them and they stop barking. 
example, if they continue barking, it's because they saw something oh, outside. Outside, outside of the roof. But if there is something outside my home, the only thing that I the only thing that I do is take my cell phone and start checking my cameras. And in that way, through through my cameras, I checking everything outside my home. If there is a car suspiciously outside, or there is a person melodating outside, or something like that. Okay. And what was the advice? Hmm. Mm -hmm. Let the police solve the problem. Okay. That was everything for part D. Let's move to part E. Uh, let's go to check the part E. Matching instruction. Ma match the phrases with the most appropriate information. What does this mean, the, the most appropriate information? The one that the most is according with the thing that is being asking for. Okay, before a young man and woman speak, they meet chat. They usually talk on the telephone. They usually talk on the set of the telephone. No. How can they we? How can we? Chat. They with my chat on the internet. They might chat with each other on the internet because internet. how they can how can they usually talk on the cell phone if they um, are if they are speaking? <laughs> no. No, don't worry. Don't worry if you are good or wrong because uh, after uh, after this we are going to to see and check if which one are good or which one are wrong. Don't worry about that. Don't worry. It is according to what you understand to the thing that you are understanding. If you were wrong, don't worry about it. We're going to correct them and to see why was that the correct answer. Okay. We said the number three, right? Let's move to the number two. Before they meet for the first time. Mm -hmm. They often in a public place, such as a they, use, they usually talk they usually on their telephone. On the telephone. Mm. Ah. ah, see, yes, yes. Oh yeah, yeah. 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 Uh, yeah, it's like a, something weird, right? But uh, I just uh, letting you see which one might be the, the the correct one, but don't worry about that. Don't worry, guys. We need to see later which one are correct. Okay, mm -hmm. let's see when they have their first day. They often meet in a public place such as a, a coffee shop. They often meet in a public place such a coffee shop. A coffee shop. Mm -hmm. coffee, so, shop. Coffee. coffee shop. Okay. Or they usually meet at a Starbucks. Ah. <laughs> okay. After they meet for the first time, they, they sometimes, sometimes another day. day. They sometimes arrange. 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 Yeah, arrange. No, no, arrange. No, arrange. No, arrange. No, arrange. It's arrange. Arrange. It is not arrange. It is arrange. Arrange. Arrange another, another day. day, another, another day. Okay, day. thank you. Yeah, don't get confused, girls. Don't get confused. Arrange is one thing, and arrange is another <laughs> different. <laughs> the, two, the two of them are completely different. Don't, don't, don't get confused. We, especially one, one it is in Spanish, and the another one it is in English. But it, the meaning it is not the same. 
<laughs> they might hear like uh, equal, but they are not. Okay, now we're going to see uh, the right answer. And, okay, wait, 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 wait. Ta 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 ta. Ooh. Before a young man and woman speak, yeah, they might chat with each other on the internet. internet. Okay. On the internet. Okay, on the internet. Mm -hmm. Before they meet for the first time, they usually talk on the cell phone. Once you met uh, or you you receive a request from someone in, 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 on Facebook, what do you do first? You start chatting. After chatting, if you want it, you might go to a, a public place and you can meet the person. But at first instance, uh, you won't like uh, at the beginning you never going to talk uh, by person with that the only thing that you do first like start chatting and sending messages and emojis after, after that after being uh, spending a, a, a lot a long time as uh, chatting you you can meet that person okay Let's see what we have here. When they have their first day. When did you have your first day? Don't you remember? No. <laughs> it was a long time ago. Huh? My first day was like, a, I think like a 10 years ago, something like that. 10 years ago. Yeah, it was like a 10 years ago, 2000, now 2023. It was in, no, it was like a, 13 years ago because it was in 2010 a long time ago okay when they have their first day they often meet in a public place such a coffee shop after they meet for the first time they sometimes arrange another day and if you like the guys or if you got if you like the girl you keep dating and dating and dating and at the end, you're going to get married. <laughs> okay, guys. And let's go to see what we have here. I think this is everything. Let me check. Yeah. Yeah. This is everything. But let me check. Courses. Okay. Guys, if you see, we already, we already the section one. Section two, now the section three, right? Section three, let's celebrate. And we already finished with the meter. We finished with the meter. What are we gonna do for the next week? The next week, we're going to start with the section four. The next time we're going to start with the section four. What, what can you do, guys? I don't know how many of you, uh, already finished the section three. I think all of you already finished the section three. Uh, I don't know if the, some of you already finished the section three. How many of you? I think all of you or, or not. Let me let me start sharing this and I'm going to put away. Okay, guys, please, uh, uh, could you raise your hands or your finger, whatever you want, in order I know if the, the one that already completed the section three. Raise your, your hand or your finger, whatever you want. Astrid, she said that you already finished. Who else? Dalila, you already finished? Okay, Marina, Maria, you already finished, Maria Magdalena? Okay, Catherine, you already finished? Yeah, Idalia, you ready? Yeah. Yes, yes. Miguel Antonio, you're done. Mm, Diana, Patricia, you're good, right? Yes, teacher. But in a section, I get late to the class. I don't see if you explain this part. 
but in the section three, when you describe the carnival, uh, you write the sentences. Um, I write the sentence and it's, it's not okay. I don't know why. Uh, okay. Diana, send me a message and I will share you the the number of that I gave to the other one. Uh, that that person is the one in charge with the platform, and he she can help you with that. She can help you with that. Okay. Uh, Lilia, Liliana Rodriguez, yes, you already finished, right? Gabriela, you're good. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Olga said you already finished. Yes, right. Teacher. Okay, Lourdes, everything. Yeah. Saul? Saul Enrique? I don't, teacher. Uh, you already finished the section three? I don't. But you have until tomorrow at midnight in order to finish because uh, okay. after that, the, the platform is going to get close the 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 section three. Okay, Claudia, teacher. I it. Okay. Claudia Margarita, hello. Hello, teacher. Uh, Claudia, you already finished the section three? Yes. Okay, thank you, Claudia. Astrid Yamilet. Oh, Astrid already told me. Don't, don't, no, no, don't, don't worry, Astrid. I forget it. Rosibel. Rosibel is not here. I think she's in her way home. Aristide. Finish, teacher. Okay. Aristide. I don't know what happened with Aristide. Okay. Carlos David Lopez. Am I? Uh, finish, teacher. Okay. Elena Maricelo Sofins. Well, okay, guys. This is what everything for today. Thank you for being paying attention. And I hope to see you on Monday. Remember, uh, we're going to keep uh, working on section four. And we're going to work with new topics. And I hope you have a great and also weekend. Take care, guys. And I hope to see you on Monday again. Thank you. Teacher. Okay, this was everything. Okay, bye-bye, guys. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night.